Born in a small village in Uttar Pradesh, K.P. Singh served in the Indian Army before a twist of fate got him into the real estate business. My father-in-law set up a company manufacturing precision electric motors with Americans as partners. And thereafter, I went to America for training. Meanwhile, my father-in-law's company name was DLF, 21 Colony House Cars. All them built by DLF. Then in 58, the government decided to nationalize this business. Private sector cannot do urban land development. When business was totally closed, my family prevailed upon me that you come and try to revive this business. So I said, how the hell do I revive it? I don't know real estate. Law is against you. No money, no organization. How do you go about? With antiquated land and urban planning laws against him and banks forbidden to lend, a chance meeting with the then Prime Minister presented the young K.P. Singh with an opportunity to share his vision. I had one thing always. Why can't I create a city? But then God helped me. There was only a 30-acre patch in Gurgaon. I was sitting there under a kicker tree, thinking, how do I revive DLF? A jeep comes around and just stopped, got, got overheated. Driver came rushing. Prime Minister So he walked up and we sat on the charpai. So he asked me, what are you doing here? I said, I'm thinking, what a place to make a township. He said, then why don't you do it? So I said, laws don't permit. He said, no, come tomorrow and give a presentation. So I gave them a presentation, prevail upon Haryana government to open up this business. And thereafter, buy land. But at that time, we could not do because you can make land contiguous by purchasing only an average of about five, six acres into, say, four, five thousand acres patch to make a city. You can't make a city in, in 200 acres. That too payable on able basis or land taken on credit is unheard of anywhere in the world. So I became a member of the farmer's family. For nearly 15 years, I devoted my time to, to accept me as a member of the family. Most farmers gave their land on credit to me. And history now today, that's how Gurgaon Township has come around. Then we could buy more land, spend it everywhere virtually. Thereafter what happens is you only make good buildings. And my son is very good in this one. You will see the buildings which he has done now. They are better than the best. I think now we are in almost, I think about 15, 20 cities or states. I think, yes, we are in Hyderabad, in Chennai, other important places in Bombay also. He never gave up. He took a great brand name, infused it with new energy, new opportunity, and that's what DLF is today. K.P. Singh persuaded the legendary Jack Welch, Chairman GE, to visit India and see the potential of the country. This visit led to the IT and outsourcing revolution in the country leading to a massive inflow of FDI and triggering a new era for the Indian economy by unlocking the potential of India's human capital. Today, around 12 lakh people live and work in Gurgaon, with more than 9,000 people directly or indirectly employed, and with a market cap of 90,000 crore rupees. K.P. Singh feels DLF is set for a great future. In my concept, Whoever does business with me, we must be all benefit. World has got so much opportunity. Concentrate heavily in what you are succeeding to deal with future growth. Ladies and gentlemen, the EY Entrepreneur of the Year Lifetime Achievement Award winner, Mr. K.P. Singh.